During Black History Month, we acknowledge the contributions of black Americans across the country. One Twitter user claims the first paramedics in the U.S. were black. Channing Curtis with our National Verify team looks into whether that's true. We know that paramedics are vital in providing life-saving treatment during an emergency. But do you know how the profession originated in the U.S.? One Twitter user claims the origins can be traced back to a group of black pioneers from Pittsburgh. But is that true? Let's verify. Our sources are University of Pittsburgh, the city of Pittsburgh, Senator John Hines History Center, Kevin Hazard, a former paramedic and author of American Sirens, and the CDC. Paramedics first became a profession in the 1960s. Before then, police officers, firefighters, and even funeral directors responded to emergencies, but offered little more than basic first aid. In 1966, the National Academy of Sciences report documented the lack of proper emergency medical care. One area that exemplified that lack of care was the Hill District, the largest black neighborhood in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. A former ambulance driver, Phil Hallen, teamed up with Dr. Peter Safar, an anesthesiologist known as the father of CPR, to create a private ambulance service to aid the residents in that neighborhood. 20 black men were recruited from the Hill District to start the first paramedic team, which would come to be known as the Freedom House Ambulance Service. At a city council meeting, Safar presented data showing that of the over 4,000 patients Freedom House paramedics transported in their first year, less than 2% died before arriving at the hospital, a vast improvement over previous methods. Kevin Hazard, a former paramedic who also wrote a book about the ambulance service, told Verify that other medical programs took notice and replicated the service, creating the paramedic services that we see today. So we can verify, yes, the first paramedics in the U.S. were black men. The CDC estimates there are now more than 200,000 professional emergency medical technicians and paramedics in the U.S. With your Verify, I'm Shannon Curtis.